Okay, Baba, what are we gonna make today? Crepes with the meat. Meat crepes, I gotta tell you. Meat crepes are my absolute favorite, but I always say that about all her recipes. Uh, I will tell you that people will fight for meat crepes, especially the way Baba does it. So Baba, what do we have to uh, do first? Cut the onion on the little squares. Okay, Baba already started cutting the onion for me because she didn't think I could do it. She thinks I'm an imbecile, right Paige? Yeah. Right. So, uh, like that? Yeah. Like that? But well, Baba, that's what I was saying to do. You're just doing it from this side instead of that side. That's right, because I'm right-handed. You are well, left. Baba! I'm not left, I'm right-handed. Okay. I, I, I look a little... Me sve drugče radimo. She just said, we do. I look a little reta retarded doing it. <laughs> Baba, have you ever cut your finger doing the onions? No. In 65 years you cooking, you've never cut yourself no, doing no, the onions? No, no, I cut when I cut meat, but not onion. Uh, okay, now like, what do I do, like that? Like that, yeah. Nice. Okay, this is how you do it. I can't look up because I'm afraid to cut myself. Well, so I don't I'm... want to, you to look on me because I don't want to cut your finger. Okay, so like that? Yes. And if I start crying, it's not because I'm emotional or anything. <laughs> it's because of the onions. Wow, they're strong. Paige is strong. No wonder you're sitting there. <laughs> Baba doesn't cry when she cuts the onion. But I'm not Baba, okay? That's it. Okay, well, I've discovered my own little way of doing it. Probably yeah, not see? the correct way it's of doing super. it. Is that good enough? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna... Now, you put one tablespoon oil in the pot. One tablespoon? Oh, my eyes are hurting. Okay. One tablespoon or teaspoon? Tablespoon. Do I put it in there as I cry my way to... See? How... Did you see how thin it is? Yeah, I did a pretty good job. I can't yes, see anything right now. <laughs> and put on the stove to saute. Okay, so it's on high. And it needs to be light brown? Light brown. Can you smell nice? Oh yeah, it smells really good. And it's on high. It's on, it's on can, 10. You can put a little down. So now it's between six and seven. And when it starts to be light yellow, put meat in. Light yellow? Yeah. That's when we put the meal. I got this at Whole Foods. I'm a big fan of uh, Whole Foods and Central Market. And I'll go to both of those stores depending on what I feel. Like for instance, on some days Central Market has really good fish. It's a light brown. Put meat in. Uh, so what do I do now? Okay, well I can do that, Baba. Yeah. Just help me do it. I'm supposed to be making this. You're supposed to be teaching me, right? Yeah. Is that isn't that the program we agreed on? Yes. <laughs> yes. yes. <laughs> well, put, then we're gonna put a little bit on 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 three to 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 meat dissolve with the onion. Yes. Okay. So and do I meat need to is cut gonna meat is gonna leave a little bit juice inside. Okay. Okay. Just leave it like that, and then when the start. Do I still do this? Yeah. Okay. Okay, I'll show you. See Lean. how it is? Yeah. Did you see? Okay, let me do it now. Just push it like that. Like that? Yeah. Steer it and just leave it. What do you mean leave it? Steer it and just Stir leave it. Stir it. Yeah. Stir and, it. Okay, and leave it to be cooked. Okay, just let it sit there? Yes. I don't know what is it about Missy. Every time we're filming this, uh, she shows and, up. And then, damn it, when you do that, you just because you you go around and sometimes Get the onions around. Down. Yes, it start to be cooked. Okay. And do now, I, do I need now, to do this? Now you can put on six. Okay, so it goes back on six. So yeah. we went from uh, ten to six to three and to six. as it got uh, more cooked or brown i see guess see how it does juice see yeah, it's I see juice. juice okay okay do i need to churn it like that just leave it and or just then leave you, it yeah oh. just leave it and then you see cook and then after short so we're making the meat first uh and then after that we're gonna make the crepes 
and then we're going to put the meat inside the crepes. Uh, you and will then, see. Oh, yeah. You will see. But well, I need to break it up, right? No, that's okay. Even when you do around, it's going to fall apart. Oh, it falls apart? Yeah. Especially on a good meat like this. Oil, this oil. Yeah. Is this the one? Baba loves this. Uh, uh, Advert I advertise, if I could, I would like to advertise this. This oil is more than perfect. When you fry, it's not grease. So, Filippo Berrio, extra light tasting olive oil, my mother recommends it. Yes. A five star chef. Yes. <laughs> uh, see, we me. need to get some of this ourselves. Me. Look, see. Is this expensive? Yes. It is? Eight dollars. Uh, Eight dollars. Well, that's not that bad, actually. It is imported from it Italia, Italy. See? Then, now, you do a little bit salt. How much salt? Just a... Pinch. Pinch. Oh, that's pinch. And then try it. And How much write. is a pinch? Like a... Well... You kind of have to go with the flow on that one, folks. Yes, and then a little bit uh, of ground that? pepper. Ground pepper. Yeah. Ground black pepper, right? Yes. Just a little bit, okay. And, and stir, how would you say? Stir it, stir not it. stir. Stir it. Stir it, and then wait <laughs> until to be. Cool. Stir is something else. Well. And it's almost getting done, it's getting nicely brownish. Uh, I can tell you that every time one of my American friends came as a little kid, teenager, to the house and had one of these meat crepes, literally I couldn't kick him out of the house. I mean, they sat there until they finished it all off. So um, I try not to invite friends when Baba's <laughs> making meat crepes <laughs> because I already have competition with my brother. Taste. Put a little bit in your mouth and taste and know what you need to give. A little bit salt uh -huh. or a little bit pepper. Okay, well obviously that depends on how you like it. Yes. Do you want me to steer, stir, steer, do you want me to steer it some more? Yeah, and just leave to be cooked. Okay, it's smells not gonna, good. It's not going to be burned. No, Because it, it does have good. inside juice. Use sea you use salt. Morton fine sea salt. It's from the Mediterranean Sea salt. Yeah. And uh, obviously Yugoslavia, uh, Croatia is on the Mediterranean, and so and is. Now uh, you can have a little spoon, Damire, and try. Allow me. Taste. Just a little bit. What do you think you, you we can need to put in? I don't think you need anything. Okay. Uh, now I've eaten this enough to know. I don't think you need anything, Baba. You're right. Because I've eaten this all my life, I can literally tell you, smell it t before even tasting it, whether the ingredients are right. And so there's no way she can put in, like, she can't cheat and put in ingredients that uh, are subpar because uh, I'm going to know it. Your smile of a be cooked. She just said a little bit more and it'll be cooked. Baba has taught me crepes before. And uh, after she taught me how to do this, what, 10 years ago? 15? 15. 15 years ago, once I learned how to make crepes, I really went crazy where I made him like every three or four days to the point where my children got so sick and tired of eating crepes. But I didn't know how to do this part. So I would just make the crepes and then uh, put his jelly inside it or put uh, walnuts or sugar or you name it. But the thing is that, and we'll see it soon, is that I made the crepes and she uh, taught me how to do it, but the problem was that I could not make him thin like you can. And I don't know of anybody else. I know my, my aunts can make crepes too, but none of the aunts that I'm aware of, Baba, can make him as thin as you can. Because yeah. even theirs are thicker yeah. like mine. Yeah. Who, who can do it? Each of us has specialty. Mine is crepes and, and uh, give it. Well, Baba, the soup is your 
super but duper special. I, we are talking about appetizers. Oh, appetizers. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, I need to. Almost got caught napping at the wheel. It's hot. Is it me done? Yeah, it's done. It's, it's time to take it off. See, when you see, when you see bottom of the dish, you don't have too much juice, and it's done. Oh, wow, okay. If you don't, if some, sometimes meat has a lot of juice. Yes. And then you put on the side. And then you have to and use then the towel, you, right? you you put like this. See, it doesn't have too much. Because That's I'm, mean, I don't have to, to do anything, it's prepared for That's the, because I bought it from Whole Foods, Baba. Okay, so if you're gonna make crepes, you can, and you're serious about it, and believe me, there's so many things you can do with crepes, might as well invest into a crepe pan. These are what, about 40 bucks? They're not cheap, they're about 40, 50 but bucks. But I gave you, you remember I gave you that kind? I know, but I don't know what it is. Okay, okay. so we, we got this thing from Walmart, it's about 120 bucks. I assembled it, it was the easy first, but it was a nightmare because I wasn't paying attention, I was trying to hurry. But we still got it done. But you know, it's not that good of a quality. So Baba, we're gonna have to get you another one, one of these That's days. That's okay. I am I'm satisfied with anything. She's been waiting ten years to get one of these. All for she good, why did you not tell me, Baba? For good cook, it doesn't matter. You, she can do anything on anything. <laughs> How many of these? Four. Four. Do you want me to do that first or do you want to do Yeah. It? Huh? That. Break the eggs? I'm gonna break four of them. Four. Now why do I do this okay. every time? I'm not paying attention. I don't know, I'll, I'll show you how. Okay. Is I got that? it, Bob. No, don't do it there. I'll do it right here. Okay. Okay, this is the fun part. How oh, I forgot how to do this. I have not made crepes um, in a long time. I used to make it when I lived in Silicon Valley because my mom was obviously not there with me. Put inside pinch of salt. <laughs> pinch. Is that it? Yeah. This is a pinch of salt, okay? Baba keeps telling me it's a pinch of salt. <laughs> okay. Put inside. <laughs> but you're gonna make salty crepes this time, right? I'll show you everything. This is measured, the perfect measure. It's like two cups, a full cup. Well, Baba, it's, we're gonna have an argument on this. No. It's not too, Cups? It's more than two cups. See? That's two cups. That's right. So it's not two cups. Look. That's measurement. I'm talking about the measurement. Uh, that measurement is like two cups, but I fill it up with flour. Okay, well it's let it's, me it's, let me okay. Let do this. It's two and a half cups, but okay. Let's let I mean we gotta show people Nice people exactly. that are watching this. Okay. okay. What it is. Here, let me put it in. No, put here two cups. Put well, no, Baba, I have to use this. Okay. I mean, how am I going to put it in there? Oh, okay. Right? Okay. Yeah, that's better. Now, let there be truth, okay? Let's see what this. Ah, Baba, I was it's right. It's almost three cups. Oh, my. It's okay. It's all two cups and three quarters. Once and for all, okay. we've settled the... Okay. Okay? Yeah, and a little bit milk. And how much I milk? I have each same milk. Let, let's measure and see. Okay, well okay. that's two and three quarters, Baba. Okay, put in that measure and see. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, two and three quarters. So two and okay, three quarters. Hold on. So two and three quarters of milk. Just put a little bit of milk and steer. Stir, stir. Not, stir. And not, not steer. Stir. 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 
I need to put more milk, Baba. Yes. Slowly, you need to make a dough without crumbs. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, you Baba, can put... Baba, why are we doing it with this? Didn't I used to use a... No, I, I like this way. <laughs> It's old type. This is old, old country stuff. Yeah. I didn't do it this way before. I, okay. I did it. Um, and you just do fluffy, fluffy like this. So you, you do around. Okay. Around to put all flowers down and do like this. Yeah, I've seen you do that before. I've seen her do it, but never offered to help her. If you do like this, and then all crumbs are dissolved, and you don't have crumbs, see? Do it. This is work. You taught me an easy way to do it last but time. But that is easy. But this is the old-fashioned way of doing it. That's so if you right. want some damn good crepes, just like they have them in Europe. Plus, this is a good exercise for uh, for your upper muscles. body. You can use that mixer if you want it. Yeah, well, it's but right. but for me, it, mixer is sometimes you need to put those and clean and everything. This is very simple. Well, <laughs> it's simple because I'm doing it. <laughs> Go ahead. And, and then how much water? It's one cup. One cup. Two, three, two and three quarters of flour, two and three quarters of um, milk, one cup of water. Okay, we had four eggs and we had a tablespoon of olive oil. Oh, what a difference no, right now. No, it doesn't go inside. Olive oil. Did no. you have olive oil earlier? No. No. <laughs> No olive oil. Let me start try. Baba, let's use a little bit, maybe a little bit salt. Maybe not. You think a little bit salt? Well, if you want it salty. Then you don't have to put anything. Okay? No, you don't need it, actually. It's become very light. It's very easy to do now. It becomes fluffy. Obviously, if you do this correctly, then you can make very thin crepes. It still amazes me when you go to a restaurant and they charge you like six dollars, seven bucks for a crepes, three crepes. And I'm like, seriously? You're charging me seven dollars for crepes? And it costs literally nothing to make crepes? See? That is pretty good dog. Let me see it. Pretty good dough or pretty good dog? Dover. Dove. <laughs> but how you said that? Batter. But, oh, excuse me. Pretty good batter, folks. Yeah. I want to play with it all day long. That's crepes done. This is what you call a Toyota production system. You actually call this like a half of a U. Um, no, shell, no, um, Jenna. Cell. No. So, With right. a spoon. Come in. With a spoon, what? Just like that, huh? You need to ma make like oily first. Usually first, you need to do like this to, to put all oil around. Now, I used to be able to flip this, Not really, me. like a true like Not French me. chef, but Baba's never been able to do it. But I have a knife and flip with the knife. I don't know if I had, uh, give me the knife, I don't know if I have the magic to do it again. It's been well, a long time. Well, you tried. When you, you feel like smoke is coming, that means the, the dish is ready for make cups. Now, one of the problems that's been throughout our life is that Baba would make him, and uh, as she made him, Danny and I would sneak in when she looked away, yeah. and we would eat him. Yes. So literally, she'd be one time, uh, well, not just once, okay, I'm trying to be nice, but no, no, I really have it more than once. We would, 
we would eat so many and then one thing she realized after 45 minutes of making crepes like literally 45 straight minutes she looked back and there was none left see it's okay, ready there there it is okay smoke it's ready okay, smoke so how much okay so you go that way so that's how you do it Uh, the first one is always the toughest. Yeah. Because uh, I guess it needs to settle down. Now, what I like doing is uh, uh, when I made them, I would uh, I would make one and then I would put it on a plate and I would literally eat it hot without anything on it and uh, that was one of my see then you do things. with it like that uh -huh. because I use a knife okay I always use knife and then just flip see she didn't need to flip it she actually made it easier but and know, it's done I wanted to a little do some bit little bit need to be same yeah like but you know what Baba I keep it a little longer because I like it burnt more I don't and Baba but doesn't. it doesn't matter for the crepes that's true it doesn't matter for the meat crepes yeah let's see I will have to show the audience what I do when you do the first one okay mm. Yeah, it's very thin. I will tell you, the the crepe is very thin. I can see it because obviously I've seen it so many times over the last 20, 30 years. Now, second, you bit. just like this. Just a little. That's bit. enough, and you can right away do it. That one's perfect. See. <laughs> <laughs> I know you can put all kinds of stuff, but I'm telling you nothing when it's hot and it's like smoking, and there's smoke out of it. It's a mm. Mm. In fact, I would eat them as I made them, so yeah. when I was making it for my kids, I would eat the first five, six, and then... Um, by the time they got to the Somet kitchen, I already was Sometimes, full. sometimes, Here, it, de it depends, wait, it depends on flour, okay? Some flour is just like, uh, uh, What flour is that? That is, uh, King Arthur. King Arthur? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put <laughs> a little bit, I'll show you. A little you more milk? A little bit. Why is that? Because uh, it's it's because the dog Padamire. <laughs> See this little bit milk put inside. Just it then low the dough is a little bit thin. It's to do, make the dough. Uh, damire, low, over, the over batter a little thinner. Two percent milk. I don't like that. Okay, but that's okay. We're gonna make. It. She doesn't like 2% milk when you're making a, making okay. a craze, but it is okay. what it is. My daughter bought now, it. Well, you now we need to kick him out because if we gonna try and make some of them. Because- Baba, th where's the crepes? But you ate. No, I didn't. I yes, you did. No. Okay, if I, I'll stop eating the crepes because if we, see, if I don't stop see eating. See what, what is mean, the dish was not ready for the crepes. Did you see? Yeah. Okay. No, it's ready now. I will take over from here and, and I promise yeah. since we have to make some meat crepes that I will not eat anymore. You need to be quick or flipping. Okay. Well, I did that pretty good, Bob. Yeah, super. We're going to try a little less. Okay, yeah, I, I put too much in. I put too much in. So, if you think crepes are really hard to do, obviously you're seeing that it's not that hard. Look, Danny. Excuse me. Look, see. Oh, mom, wow, look at that. 
Pa Damire, neću ti dati da pečeš. Jer nećemo nikad ispeći, my goodness. He is impossible. Impossible. I promise. Who promised you? Promised me for. Oh my goodness! He finally you got a little. Well, he has three, but he gave you just two or more. Great panties, really hot. What do you have it on? What did you have? Nine. On? She had nine. it on nine. So, it's it's happening now. It's time to rock and roll. See? And now you do like this. Done. Don't burn yourself. No, I'm not. I think we're going to reverse roles today. I'm going to be the supervisor. Yeah, I agree. Because Baba is afraid I'm going to eat all the crepes. Baba, for our showboating, I'm going to have to do one later. Flip one up in the air. See? Dame it. See? It does go by itself. That's really experience because, my God, I cook more than... How long, Baba? Let the audience know. At least 65 years. At least. So Baba is 80 years old. She had me when I was... Uh, she had me when she was 60. So I'm 20 years old. No. <laughs> Just a little sprinkle. I must say that when you're doing this, you gotta roll it like really quickly because you want it even. You want the crepes to be really even. And, because and if you look at how Baba yeah. does it, it's, it's very even. So that's one reason why she's able to, uh, to have it thin, thin. I used to make for things you mean 100. 100? And how long would it take you? For a full hour. Wow, but that's still fast. 100, 100 crepes in one hour? That's, that's a machine. Notice how the, the smoke is coming out, so it's that basically it's telling it's done. So now you're probably averaging what? One every 30 seconds? Yeah, you can say that. Because of the uh, being on number nine high, so. We have neighbor across, and we were very good friends. They moved to Iowa. Uh-huh. And before they move in April, I asked him, what do you want me all? He said, please make crepes for me. And I... I uh, what type? Meat crepes? Meat crepes. Uh -huh. And I put in the box and he said, all the way from here to Iowa, he was eating my crepes. That's a long way, folks. But I think I need to try to you do the flip. Oh, do a little showboat. Okay. You try. Showboating. You try. The English me. call it that showboating. Hey, it's my program now. Okay. You're trying to teach me how to do it, right? See, perfect. Uh, it wasn't that perfect, but it's good. Okay, I try to make it even as possible. You need to go around if you want to flip it. Yeah, no. Should I try the flip first time or should I try warm up a little bit? Well, just try. Huh? Uh, try, uh, yeah. Okay, here's how I used to do it. Years. Yes. Ten years since I flipped one. Yeah. This teaches you another uh, point of the uh, episode, which is really not part of the show, but I will say it. Once you learn how to ride a bike, you don't you forget. You never it. forget. And so, once Baba teaches you how to make this delicious food, well, guess what? You actually can forget it because you can go back to the video and look at the video and then re recall how you did it. So that's the power of using digital uh, technology to do it. And then, I just flip it like that. Oh, it's a beauty. It is an absolute beauty. Yes. It's okay. Now, in the meat, you put one egg. In the meat, you put one egg. 
Do we do it now? And mix together because egg is... The egg is going to uh, bond all the rest of yes. the meat together. Yes. This is for the... Uh, now, we're, this is for the part where we put the, the meat into the crepes and roll them up, right? Right. I can show you and then you can go to... Where's the where's the where's the crumbs? But then you uh, we can make and you can go buy crumbs and. You don't have crumbs, Baba. You don't have crumbs. Name a micho crumbs. I guess this is wait wait wait, Baba. Is this uh, Baba's rule number two of cooking? If you want to make something, okay, you gotta make sure you have all the ingredients. That's right. <laughs> One spoon is yeah, enough. One, one spoon. One okay. spoon. It's it, and then you do on the side, on the side, on the side, and a simple roll it. Okay. Well, let me do the next one, just like that. Okay. Allow me to be the maestro chef. Nice, nice spoon. Nice yeah. spoon. Nice. That's nice. Like that. Da. Nice spoon. Uh, a little bit that's more, enough. I think. Yeah, damn it. A little bit that's more. That's enough. Put, put like, like a sausage. Okay, like, like a sausage. Yeah, that's right. Okay, now. Roll it this nene, side. on the side. Oh, hold like on. This. Let me do it, Baba. Let me do it. I can't learn it if I don't do it. Right? Right. On the side like this. This. And, and the other side. Yeah. Well, it's a little sticky right now. Hold on. But that's okay. Like that? Yeah, and roll it. This side? Yeah. First. Nice, roll it like a sausage. Like a sausage. Uh, it needs to be tight. It's tight, Baba. It's not nice. Yeah, it is. Not. Needs to be a little wider, I guess. Okay, I needed to push it a little harder. Okay, See? I needed to be a little, needed to be a little wider too. I had it too short. That's right. Okay. Okay, uh, we rolled uh, 19 of the crepes, meat crepes. Uh, so one pound will make about 19. Actually, Baba tells me it makes 20. About 20, which means that I didn't do it as well as Baba. I put a little too much meat in uh, on the average. A couple too a much couple meat. Yeah. And then Baba forgot to have some bread uh, crumbs, so she told me to go and get Progresso bread crumbs plain. They are the best. They're the best, she says. One of the things also I wanted to point out, but Baba taught me that she didn't say earlier, is that the reason you have to pack them tight is so that the meat doesn't come out, right? That's right. So they, see, I learned that from you last time that you yeah, were telling me right. about it. Yeah. So that's why you got to make sure they're tight. So if any of these uh, uh, gets broken up while we're may frying them, right, uh, that's my fault because I didn't get it right now. So now what, what's the first thing, Baba? You can, you have two dishes, one with bread crumbs. Put it how much? Half. No, I'll tell you. Don't put too much because after you one and another and another, if you put in egg beater and crumb, it start to be like crumb, crumbs, not, not. So it'll be like in clumps? Yes. Oh, okay, all we, right. We put that. So like that, and then now what? Now we're going to have egg beater. But how much? Oh, just egg beater? Egg beater. But how much of it? Does it matter? Egg beater. Egg beater is like that. Okay. And you put half of, of if you, you can put two like this egg beater mm -hmm. and half milk. Okay, so a little bit, okay, so. And then you mix it. You mix I it. I know, Baba, but what's the, you know what? I'm not, I don't, what, what, how much is this actually? How much quality, quantity is this? How much is this? Two. Oh. Yeah, two what? You buy ready that, oh, that this in the ready. store. <laughs> you have three in one package. <laughs> you use how much you want it, okay? Oh, and what was in here? So you put this. Yeah, was, you put here. So this was how many of these? 
two. two, and then you put milk into that, right? L uh, milk, like half milk, and mix together. Okay, so just and to make sure, uh, with the, she used two of these. She put it in here, and then she put half a milk, whole yes. meat. Yes, and put in the plate. And put it in the plate. plate. Put it in the plate. You put a little bit salt in. A little pinch. Pinch salt. Pinch salt. And mix. Mix. And mix it. Well, you could, you put This is olive oil again. Yes. Your favorite olive oil. How much do you yes, put? Yes, for the frying. How much do you put? Uh, well, let's ah, see. Like frying. I don't okay. put too much. I don't put like you fry chicken. Okay, so it's a lot less. It's... Okay. So now, it's not going to cover it all the way, right? That's right. Okay. You need to flip both sides. I'm, and now I've you seen put, you do that before. Now you put on the nine. On nine, okay. When when is oil ready? Then you put you put. Oh, uh, do you put this in there and then you, you roll it? You put in the egg beater that's very healthy, and you you roll it. Okay. And I put in the plate in this frying pan I can put eight. Oh you can put eight. So yeah. I'm gonna do it this way, right? Yeah. Like that? Yes. Like that? Yes. And then I'll I'll show you something very is there specific. A better way of doing it? Yeah, very uh, put on the side too. Oh, okay. I did put do here. That. Okay. The point on in the rolling is yes. not to roll opposite, to be unrolled. Oh, right. Like like this. See? Oh, I got it. Duh. Yeah, you gotta go with the with the grain. It needs to be all the way covered yes. on the sides too. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that one. That's okay. Horrible. It's okay, Damir. It is horrible. Okay. <laughs> it is called. <laughs> like that. Yeah. Like that, Damir. It is horrible. <laughs> Thanks, Baba. When you think you don't have enough crumbs, you just I put don't a little I don't bit, have enough crumbs. little bit, a little bit, and do it. When. Don't be scared, Damir. <laughs> okay? Okay? You know what, Baba? Then, I, I, then I'm usually, not scared. Okay? Then usually, usually put like this here. A little and bit? when it starts to blow, it means the oil oh, is ready. Oh, really? Wow, yeah. that's kind of cool. That's pretty cool. So you can put how many? I usually six, seven. This is a fried dish. And I'm not one of those uh, guys that eats a lot of fried food, but I will tell you, it's quite delicious. Not uh, now. Not now? Okay. Not right now, it's quite delicious. Um, and uh, it's very filling. I mean, if you have uh, two of these, well, I have more of the red. Just two of these uh, will fill you up. So. Uh, one pound of hamburger meat, good hamburger meat, makes 20 on the average. So she would make the, this whole thing one day, and then if she knew that the guests were coming, uh, she would uh, then the following day she would just fry it, right? Before they come Before one hour. Before they come one hour. So now you think like, wow, superwoman. She just made these incredible meat crepes, and they're still extremely fresh. But Baba, you can't really wait more than one day, right? So you really you want can, to... You can make can you those wait? and put in the freezer. And you won't know the difference? How long can you put it? Week? Five, three days? What? Couple of weeks. So you want to freeze them like this, and then you can have it in there like for a couple of weeks, and then the last phase, stage, so remember there's three phases, uh, the meat uh, phase, the crepes, and then combining it to an, into the batter. Notice how all the sides are uh, uh, cooked well and even the, the, this, the, the ends. So my, my, see, and nothing broke up, right? Nothing broke no, up. No, no. Nothing. So I actually did a good job of rolling the, the, the meat within the crepe. The rolling needs to be tight because then crepes can unroll itself. Right, okay. Now you can put oil. So how much? Put, put. Doesn't matter, I can use that later. Just put some more. I think now is enough. And then also I did not finish this up because Baba did not want me to put it on top of the other crepe. So you never want to put it on top because she didn't want to see it squished. 
So literally Six. about, okay, Six. eight. Uh, Six. That one is not tight. That's the one that I did that was horrible. Okay, it's okay. not greasy like when you fry usually yeah I think that's one of the things that the Americans are surprised when they come to Baba's house that never had this is they see it fried and so they're assuming that it's gonna be very greasy but it's quite the opposite it, it really doesn't feel like fried food that's what I think is magical about it Baba yeah. You know that? No, I know. And, and so that's why the Americans that come and first time taste their meat crepes, they're pleasantly surprised and that's why they want to take it all home. Of course, I am the meat crepe guardian. The crepes stay in the house. So you either eat them here or you don't take them home with you. No. Okay? Mmm. Mm. It's just, it's magnificent. So Baba, uh, I'm gonna tell you how I love to eat this. I love to have at night like a, a glass of red wine. And then if you have a glass of red wine with one or two of these, it's beautiful, it's just perfect. But Baba, what, how else can you fix this? Because uh, this is actually an appetizer in Yugoslavia, but ironically, it's a meal. So you gotta be careful because if you eat like two or three of these, you're not gonna be able to eat anymore because it's so delicious. You can have that uh, roasted pepper, cut in the slices, uh -huh. put on the side uh -huh. instead green salad. Okay. You want to okay. try it? Well, uh, had it, Baba, but quite also, uh, what else? Uh, what else can you put in here? So you can put chicken in there, right? Uh, yeah, ground chicken is like uh, less. How can I say? It's uh, less fatness. Less fattening than than okay. Than beef, of but course. it depends what kind of beef you have. Well, this was ninety percent yeah, lean. I, I could have should have bought ninety five yeah. percent probably. Um, and. Uh, that's it? Yeah. Well, that's it. We're done. It, that's, you know what? That is salty crepes. So, these are salty crepes, salty meat crepes. And I just want to say that it's so easy to eat them, but now I truly appreciate the effort and the process that uh, Baba has done for me for uh, 20 years. So uh, I can say I've probably eaten this how many times, Baba? God knows. <laughs> I remember, I remember when I came to, to California, you were there and you have company, big company. And uh, I was trying to make uh, uh, that chocolate pick, pick uh -huh. cake and we didn't have, you didn't have grounder. And then we went to Macy's to buy grounder and I made that cake. And we made the crepes. Well, what's that got to do with crepes? I'm well, <laughs> well, you know why? Because <laughs> crepes, crepes was like for the dinner. Yes. And cake was like for the dessert. dessert. There you go. So this is an appetizer that's actually a full meal. Okay. Thank you so much. Until next time.